Welcome back, folks. I want to hook up some of all these uh, industries that we have around our towns today so that we get the benefit from them. And they're all going to be hooked up by trucks. So, for instance, we're, we're doing mail down here, right? Um, uh, so, so we hooked that up and we are getting some mail. Um, so that's fine now for instance this uh, green bay oil well why not have a truck go down here offload some uh, crude and the spine car spine fluid hauler can just take it wherever it needs to go uh, the same with this plastic um, and this mail up here this uh, meat processing plant here there are so many things we can do and just get it on those uh, spine haulers and going wherever it needs to go which i think will be nice and i think the first thing i want to do is probably hook these three up uh so no, because that would mean that we need a new line. Because they go on uh, flatbed cars. So we'll have a flatbed hauler as well. And we'll have a, um, a hopper hauler. But this crude... Uh, down here at Green Bay, we can definitely do right. So let's let time pass a little bit. So we continue up through the dates. We'll do a I think we'll do something like this. We just need one platform. Yeah, for now one platform is fine and then we need a new line going from there to there and we'll make it uh, let's make it that color and we'll call it uh, green bay um crude to train or to spine to spine okay and then we need some trucks on that oh that's uh that's not the one that we want don't we have a i guess not we do up here Um, and it'll be the Peterbilts, it'll be tankers, and we'll get, let's say five of them for now. We'll make them the color and put them on Green Bay uh, crew to spine. So they will come down here and Tacoma Oil Refinery is a consumer. Okay, so that's something that's going. Uh, I'm kind of thinking of adding a train to this. What's our rate on this at the moment? Uh, 
Let's get two more trains on that. And then we have... That's also fluid. That's cargo. 418. Let's get two more on that. Okay. 387 people waiting there. What about down here? 580 people waiting to go to Burrieta. And the Murrieta Timacula can definitely do with some more trains. Uh, 412-2 class. Uh, it's a steam train, right? They don't exist anymore. You know what? We're going to replace... with the Metro Liner. Hey! A lot of different little cargo things waiting here. Train 70. Um, is it down here? up here why can't you Do you have a path oh that's why okay well uh, let's pause for a second Tracks. Uh, hi. There we go. No. So it was hanging out over the station a bit, and that was why it couldn't. Uh, yes, one way, no auto signals, please. Okay. Well, that's all good. And we can let the dates roll a little bit. There's a bit of mail on board. That's about it. There's some mail here as well. Okay, so our trucks have arrived down here. What's our rate on this line? 706, that's fine for now at least. Okay. So we have some oil sitting here for some reason. Okay. How are we getting oil up here? I don't know. All right, well, uh, we are going to 
uh, upgrade these roads. Up to here. And also out to Billings here. Ooh, new ship. Nice. Okay. Now that is actually something that I've been wanting to do as well. Uh, down here in Manchester. Get a um, ferry going from Manchester and down to Columbia. I think that could be kind of cool. And maybe get a ferry going, I don't know, up to Temecula? From, uh, from Joliet or something? Don't have that many people waiting. We have 26 on board, it's not too bad. 43 on board. 15 on board. 35 on board. It's not too, too bad. It's not too, too bad. Alright. Now, what else do we want to uh, get hooked up today? Uh, let's get this hooked up. The mail sorting center over here. So... We just need one. Uh, yeah, we just need one. And I think we'll configure this and... So this has to be out, right? Yep. Uh, can I bulldoze this bit? Yes. And this is in. Construction not possible. Dang it. I think we'll use this one instead uh, with just one. And let's see. I think we'll do this and this. Okay. So that's that. Then we need a new route or a new line from there to there. And Color is fine, I think. And this will be Fresno mail boarding to fine. All right. Five vehicles, Peterbilts it will be that one. And we'll get four trucks for that. No, let's get six trucks for that. Fresno mail sorting to spine. Oh, I forgot to give them their color. 
All right, so there they go. And you know what? I think... Um... Hmm. I kind of want them to go around the town. So something like that. And I should get them going that way. Okay. So that's hooked up, then we will get... You know what, let's do these three and we'll put in a spine uh, bat bed with stakes. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I think that's probably a good idea. So let's um, so annoying. I have to do like this. And then We can do... Hmm. What are those? Let's do something like that. What the heck are those? It looks like platforms. What is that? Oh, it it's platforms from over here. Okay. You don't want to destroy it. Something must have gone wrong. It doesn't destroy it. Okay, weird. All right, well, I guess we'll have those platforms there. Okay. So we're going to need... three of these. And we actually have tools factory up here so it's perfect and we have a plank thing down here let's just do it all the way there So my reasoning here, and I think I've mentioned it before, is that I want to try and hook up just a bunch of um, of different industries, get them going on the spine line. It doesn't have to be uh, super efficient f uh, from the from the industries. I just want it moving on the spine lines so that, for instance, uh, this Memphis sawmill, if we put uh, some trucks on that, then we can, we basically have planks that can be used by anything that wants planks. That's my idea. So for instance, up here, these planks would go on the spine line here, be taken up here, uh, be turned into tools and then the tools would go on the spine line 
and we'd have more tools going without really doing much for it. Um, so yeah, that, that's, that's my idea. Right, so if we... Let's start down here. Um, we just need one terminal in these. Hmm. We want to put it in like this? No, I don't think so. I think I want to put it in like this. And then streets. We can put one in there. And then put one in there. And that gives us a little bit more room to work with. And I think we'll do the same here. Let's uh, put a wall around this one. Then we need one up here. Something like that. Great. So the question is, do I like this better? I think I do. We do have uh, one ways. Yeesh. That looks weird. Doesn't it? Alright, it'll be fine. Um, okay. So that's those three. Uh, I think I'll put another truck station in here. Let's see. Let's put that in there. And then we'll get some new lines going. Uh, from there to there. Uh, color is fine. This will be, I guess, clean. Logs to spine. Okay. And then a new line from there to there. And that'll be Fresno logs to spine. And then another new line from there to there. And this will be... The forest was called Killeen Forest, so Killeen logs to spine two. Okay.
Then we need down here. Um, we need to get this in here. I think I'll try with this one. All right, so that is in. Then we need a new line from there to there. And this line will be logs, uh, spine logs to Memphis planks. Uh, because if we take a look here, uh, cargo Peterbilt. Yeah, this one doesn't take uh, planks. This one does. And this one doesn't take planks. So we'll need another new line going from there to there. And this will be Memphis planks the spine. Okay. And they're going to have to go through town with that, which is noisy and traffic -y, but that's just the way it's going to have to be. And then up here, we don't need to take it anywhere because it's just there. So I guess we'll buy some vehicles. Uh, let's buy six for each. And it was Killeen, wasn't it? Killeen logs to spine. Uh, it's blue, I think. I think it's this one. Uh, Killeen logs to spine. Then we'll buy another six. Um, I think it was that color that Colleen Logs to Spine 2 was. Well, it looks about right. And then we have another six. Uh, which will be Fresno Logs to Spine. And it's that color, I think. There's no logs to spine. Okay. So that's a lot of trucks on their way. Then we need buy some trucks for this. And we need some Peterbilts. And uh, we need Well, we say 12 and this will be Memphis uh, uh, Memphis where is it now create a Memphis planks to spine so oh no so it's spine uh, logs to planks and it's, I think it's this color, spine, 
logs to Memphis planks. And then we'll buy some more vehicles. Uh, 12. And this is Memphis planks. The spine. And it's this color. Is it that one? I think it's that one, but I don't know. Memphis planks to spine. Okay, we have an autosave going. And he's finished auto saving. Thank you. And once we make our new spine uh, stake line, we'll be getting tools up here from Madison Tools Factory as well for the spine cargo line. So, new line. From down here to here to here to here to here to here to up here to up here to up here to up here up here and then all the way back again it's a pretty some pretty crazy lines but i like it uh, frisco and back to virginia beach Okay, uh, let's make you red. And this will be spine uh, steak line. It's like spine steak baller. Yeah. Okay. Then we just need to find a depot. We have a depot here. Five vehicles. Uh, we want... I think I want the big boys. And... These flat cars with side stakes. They only do 120. But so don't do the box cars. So it's fine. So let's make these around 320 meters long. 328 is just a tad too much. So there. And buy it. Make it red. And put it on spine stakeholder. And we are obviously going to need more than one. So we have. Let's clone. 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 Let's put five on it for now. Okay. We're pretty much full. It's nice. Um, I don't like that that train is sitting way back there. Um, let's... Put this here. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Alright. So, let's see. Now that we have a train on here, are these producing? Yeah. They're producing. And we should start seeing some logs here. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very nice. That means that you will have no consumers, but you have some suppliers. You should have uh, you should have a Madison Tools Factory should become a consumer. Okay. We have some logs sitting here. What's our rate on this one? 510. What's the rate on this one? 406. And on this one, 751. Uh, and what about these? Uh, thousand and eleven. That's fine. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, do we have logs sitting here? We do. We have twenty logs. We have some crude. Which is a little weird. Uh, what's the rate on this one? 568. Uh, do we want to increase that? I'm not sure. Because we're, we're not using that much of it, so I think it's fine. What do you have? 3115? <laughs> well, that's, that's not good. It might not be possible to do what I want to do, but I'm hoping that it is. It's a test because I haven't seen anyone else try it. Five million it made that there that train, which is great. And you're empty basically. You picked up some oil and some crude. 
And there should be crude waiting for you down here. Some at least. Yeah. Okay. Are we getting any mail? Yeah, we are. What's the rate on that? 259. It's not enough. Okay. There's all the state vehicles that are getting over to their routes, which is fine. Wonder why there's still crude sitting here. I don't get that. But it's fine. We have one crude going up to Madison. Why is not there a crude going up to Madison? Madison doesn't need crude. But we do have some fuel sitting here. So the tank truck here should be picking up that. And no, you didn't pick up anything. Okay. But I think it's it's kind of a fun way of doing things. It's a little bit different than what everyone else does, where they do dedicated lines for everything. This is more of a a mix of everything being sent around the place, which I think I like. Which I think I like. Let's take a quick look at the lines. But we're not making quite as much money uh, as we were, but because we put extra cars on there. But once these things get up and, and going, uh, it should be fine. I hope. Um, where is there a stake train? I don't see a stick train. Uh, that's not a stick train. That's not a stick train. Where the hell is there a stick train? There. They're still coming out. Now, are there some logs down here that we could pick up, maybe? There are right there. Send them over to Virginia Beach. And we actually, up here at Manchester, we're using logs as well. So we could put a state drain on, on this line as well. an idea. How many logs are sitting here now? 238, not bad. All right, so pretty good, pretty good. All right, so we're in 1981, and that is the year that I moved away from Denmark from the first for the first time. Uh, my dad was no longer a mechanic and my mom and dad didn't have their dancing schools anymore so um my dad was now uh, a flight engineer so the third man in the cockpit and he got a job at uh, kuwait airways so we moved to kuwait and my dad 
flew out of there for, uh, for several years. And I started going to English school at four years old in, in Kuwait. So my first school was not Danish, it was English. So yeah, a little bit more about myself here in 1981. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe? I'll see you next time.